Hey guys, Drew here for Z Code System. Great to be back with you here on YouTube. As today, we're going to take a look at the Caraboa Cup semifinal matches that are coming up tomorrow, Wednesday, January 12th, and Thursday, January the 13th. And these games are pitting four of the biggest teams in England against each other in the Caraboa Cup semifinals. And uh, we're going to be coming up with the final, uh, I believe it's going to be in early March. And uh, we're just uh, one step away from that uh, that final taking place and the first trophy in English football, uh, top flight English football, being handed out this year. Now, great to have you back here with us. Before we go any further, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on all your notifications so you're up to date on everything we post here on YouTube from Z Code System. And as you can see there, we've got the blog in front of you. You can go over there anytime you want to read up on all the picks that we post. And if you're not a member yet, go over to zcodesystem.com, sign up today to get the best tools on the internet for betting on sports, whether it be soccer, baseball, basketball, NHL, hockey, whatever it is that you're going to be betting on, get over there, sign up, and join us today. Of course, the NFL playoffs are beginning shortly, and uh, the Super Bowl is coming up, the biggest betting event in American sports. So if you're not a member, you, want, you might want to get onto that now so you can get our picks and systems for the NFL playoffs and the Super Bowl. All right, guys, let's take a look at the Carabao Cup semifinals, pitting four of the biggest teams in England against each other. We've got Chelsea taking on Tottenham Hotspur, and we've got Arsenal and Liverpool playing as well. So let's take a look at those right quick. Okay, now before I actually give you the picks for these games, I just wanted to take you over to my favorite betting sports book, and that is Bet365. We're going to take a look at the odds, the outright odds, for the teams to win the Caraboa Cup. And as you can see there, I've got fractional odds, which is my preferred odds system, but I'm going to show this to you also in American odds coming up in just a second. Okay, so there are our American odds uh, for all of our fans over there across the pond and a lot of the sports bettors. I know American odds are very popular with a lot of sports fans uh, and a lot of sports bettors. I prefer my uh, my personal pref my personal preference, I should say, is uh, fractional odds, but I'll give this to you in American odds here. As you can see there, Chelsea are currently the favorites at plus 100 to lift the Caraboa Cup. Liverpool plus 187, Arsenal plus 350, and Tottenham Hotspur plus 1600. Now, the reason for this here is because Chelsea won that first leg match against Tottenham Hotspur. The semifinals of the Caraboa Cup are two-legged. Uh, so a two-legged series, teams will both play at home. Uh, both teams in each series will play at home, I should say. Uh, Chelsea won the first leg against Tottenham Hotspur at Stamford Bridge 2-0. They were all over Tottenham early on and uh, really outplayed them on the day, picking up a 2-0 win. So they go into the second leg of the semifinals on Wednesday at Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, up two goals. Spurs are going to have to score at least two goals without conceding to force extra time in that game. And as you can see there, Liverpool are second favorite in odds, followed by Arsenal. Now, those two teams were set to play their semifinal last week, uh, last Thursday. Uh, but unfortunately, Liverpool had a COVID-19 outbreak. They had the game postponed due to not being able to field enough players, as well as having uh, a number of coaches off uh, and unable to uh, to be on hand and to train the team as well in the in the build up for it, uh, the the Liverpool training ground was closed due to the COVID nineteen outbreak. But now it looks like things are going to be just fine. Uh, I guess you could say just fine uh, for the game. Liverpool did play over the weekend in the FA Cup, as did Arsenal, and uh, yeah, so they're going to play their first leg now this week at Anfield in Liverpool, with the second leg taking place a week from Thursday at. Arsenal's Emirates Stadium. So you'll have another chance to bet on the Caribou Cup semifinals again next week. All right, let's take a look at the picks courtesy of Soccer Buddy and a courtesy of myself. If you've never used the Zico System Soccer Buddy tool, all you need to do is go to the bonus tools section and you'll, there you will find Soccer Buddy. We're going to click on that and that's going to take us over to the Soccer Buddy tool uh, app there. And as you can see here, we've got it on all leagues. So actually I want to change my date, a uh, date for the 12th and then change from all leagues to England EFL cup, the EFL cup, AKA the Caraboa cup, uh, for this pick. And as you can see here, we have a pick a two to one win for Tottenham Hotspur over Chelsea at Tottenham Hotspur stadium, courtesy of the soccer buddy tool. Now, that first leg game, Chelsea were all over Spurs early on. They got two goals in the first half. Second half, Spurs were slightly better. At the end, uh, the game finished 2-0 with uh, no goals in the second half. Now, Chelsea are playing brilliantly right now. They're on a 10-game unbeaten run in all competitions, and they picked up a big win 
at the weekend over Chesterfield in the FA Cup third round. I believe it was 5-1 in the end. Chelsea got the win, uh, which was also played at home. Now, Chelsea are fantastic against Spurs. A great head-to-head against Tottenham Hotspur. Uh, They are seven wins, three draws, zero losses over the course of the last 10 games in all competitions against Tottenham Hotspur. I'm going against the soccer buddy pick. I don't think Spurs are going to be able to pick up a win against Chelsea. And I think Chelsea are going to pick up a win and progress easily into the final at Wembley of the Carabao Cup. I I think that Tottenham are just not going to have enough. Even though they have the likes of Harry Kane, Lucas Moura and Deli Alli, this is a team that is still a ways away uh, from the level of Chelsea. And I think Chelsea's defense will do very well in this game. I see Chelsea picking up a win in this game against Tottenham Hotspur. Okay, let's take a look over at that Liverpool game now, which is going to take place on Thursday. So we're going to just check that or change that over to the 13th with Liverpool hosting Arsenal. And we've got a pick of 3-1 to one Liverpool win at Anfield. And I'm going to say a win against that previous pick. I went against the Spurs uh, Chelsea pick uh, in that, and I picked Chelsea. I like this pick. I like this pick a lot. Uh, Liverpool to pick up the win in the first leg of the semifinal. Liverpool stuttering a bit lately, but they are coming off of a 4-1 win at home against Shrewsbury Town in the FA Cup's uh, third round. Arsenal, on the other hand, they lost away to Nottingham Forest 1-0 in the Carabao, or excuse me, in the FA Cup third round. So they're going to limp into this game. Um, Arsenal have uh, lost their last two games in all competitions to Man City and to Nottingham Forest. And they're going to be taking on a very good Liverpool team. Now, keep in mind, Liverpool do still have players coming back from COVID-19 uh, positive uh, positive cases. Uh, they have a few injured players, and they're going to be missing two of their most important players in Sadio Mane and Mohamed Salah, who are both gone to the African Cup of Nations. Now, if you're not familiar with the African Cup of Nations, check out our blog because we've got some uh, info on the African Cup of Nations and we also have a video up here on YouTube. So check that out. We're going to be covering that even more this month going on. Arsenal are also missing some players to the African Cup of Nations. Thomas Partey, uh, Pierre Emerick Obama Yang. Uh, they're also missing uh, Mohamed El Nini. So uh, and Nicolas Pepe, I should uh, Nicolas Pepe is also going to be uh, gone for the game. So four big players gone for Arsenal, three big players gone for Liverpool. So both play- both teams missing players for this game. But uh, I still think that Liverpool are going to have the win in the end. I think that they're going to be too much for Arsenal. Uh, Arsenal, although a good team uh, and so far a good cup team in the Carabao Cup, just they don't have the, the players that Liverpool do. And playing at Anfield, Liverpool are typically unstoppable. Now, Cast your mind back to the quarterfinals of the Carabao Cup. Liverpool were down at 1.31 in the second half to Leicester City, and they came back to win that game um, on penalties, uh, in a penalty shootout. Uh, And that tying goal that Liverpool got from Takumi Minamino came in the fifth minute of second half stoppage time. Uh, Pretty much a Hail Mary from James Milner into the box, chested down by Takumi Minamino and volleyed, half volleyed into the back of the net. So Liverpool, with a bit of magic on that night, the cop sucking in the ball there uh, at the cop end of the stadium. And I love Liverpool, obviously, to win this game uh, going forward. And I think Liverpool will win the tie in the end. And I like that scoreline 3-1. Keep in mind, Liverpool already defeated Arsenal in the Premier, in the Premier League this season at Anfield 4-0. Arsenal have improved since then, but... I don't think that they're going to be able to stick with Liverpool and Liverpool are going to pick up a victory with over 2.5 goals, both teams scoring on Thursday night. All right, guys. So those are my picks for the Carabao Cup final, excuse me, the Carabao Cup semifinal coming up on Wednesday and Thursday night. And guys, if you want to get more great picks like these from the Soccer Buddy and from the other tools we have at Z-Code System, go join up today and you can be a part of the family and you can use all of these tools to get picks on all the various leagues from around the world, including that Africa Cup of Nations I mentioned earlier, which I'm going to be profiling a little bit more later on this week. All right, guys, hit that like button, hit subscribe, get the notifications from us, and we'll see you next time here on Z-Code System when we are profiling the Africa Cup of Nations.